All right, Todd here with Jeep Speed Shop, here to talk about how we install an engine. So we use an engine leveler, this thing right here. I've had this for 20 years, <laughs> had it for a long time, works out really well. We also use this crossbar right here. And also eight millimeter bolts by one, two, five, and it's about an inch, I'd say, long. And on the cylinder head, there are four locations. There's that one, the other two in the back. Now, we use a hook. So if you can see down there, so on the chain right here, there's a hook, and it's hooked around that round piece there that the, um, timing cover to the cylinder head, which is the same bolt that we use, but I use a hook and we just hook it around that. It actually works really good. So, and I've been doing it this way since day one. Um, and then using the engine leveler, you can set, it's hooked to our crane, but you can set the, you know, how you put it in you can you dive bomber in and then level her out when you get inside and the engines actually stay really level and it works out really well you know and i've had another guy ask me some questions so these bolts there's four of them one two three four those are all three eighths coarse thread all right and then these this one going to the starter and then this one here only in the eight speed, these are all metric also. So don't put three eighths bolts in those areas. So, and I think that's about it on this video, but just to show how we um, cradle the motor when we put them in to these JKs and this works. Now the back half of this, will hit the firewall a little bit, but it'll work. And then, you know, put the bolt in mounts and then doing the manifolds all this stuff goes together like this. So this is going into a Jeep. Manifolds are on. We'll put the mounts on, but they're not on right now. Okay, we're prepping this one because, you know, did the, you know, set the um, sensor for the fan. Do that before the engine's in. And manifolds, we had to change this one. All right, this is the passenger side we needed to dump down. So, because we're now using truck manifolds, no more Grand Cherokee. So this is just a prep setup here. And mostly we're talking about our engine leveler, how to install it. And you get these things on Amazon or wherever, you know, but this works the best and it's not hitting anything on the engine, you know, gonna break off a sensor or break the manifolds or whatever. It, this works really well. So this is the way to do it, no doubt. So, all right. Well, I think that's all for this video, but this is, Basically, we're touching on what you do before you install it into the Jeep, engine level wise, actually, just using it this way. It makes it super simple. I've only been doing it this way since day one and it's been working great and everybody's been ha had really good luck with it. And this one here also, before you're putting it in, you know, I got a thread, you know, tap the side of the tranny. So all prep before you install it into the Jeep. All right, I think that's it for this one. Jeep Speed Shop, out.